I, Joseph Robinette Biden Jr., do solemnly swear. Think about the challenge that Biden faces. He's in adversarial relationships from the start. In December, we kept asking for the plan, and there wasn't a plan. Even in that moment of joy of renewal, people were extremely conscious of the inheritance we had. We were playing catch up from the moment the president took office. It was incredibly challenging around here. Don't tell Dr. Fauci how many pieces of gum I've swallowed. This is a period of remarkable division in the country. Delta was raging. Things were really falling apart. It's time to end the forever war. Biden's cabinet are not stupid people, and they got this really wrong. President Ghani said to me on the phone, I will stay and fight to the death. He fled the country the next day. The United States has never seen an adversary like this before. We are in a global struggle, and autocracy's on the rise. I knew the moment would come when you would need old alliances. That moment came with Ukraine. We began to pick up a massive Russian military buildup. So we go to Moscow quietly. I found President Putin to be unapologetic. His appetite for risk has grown. I conveyed serious consequences that would flow from military aggression. The Biden administration learned from the mistakes made in Afghanistan. They responded by getting out ahead of events instead of being behind them. We're living at an inflection point in history. We're engaged in a struggle between democracy and autocracy. They're betting that democracy's days are numbered.